you know that you're supposed to use your body in your short shots as well as in your long shots? A lot of people don't realise this and they think, oh, this is just a little pitch, just a little chip. Um, I'll just use my hands and arms. And then you'll get this sort of very awkward, wristy, stabby sort of motion. It's really important to incorporate the bigger muscles even in the short shots, even in your putting actually, to be honest. So feel that this is moving the club back and through, turning back and through. Obviously it's less than it would be on a full swing, but it's kind of the early part, if you like, of what a full swing would be in terms of the amount of turn that you get. Can you see how it all seems a bit connected? There's that old tip where you put something like a glove or a towel underneath your um, armpit. You can do both sides if you want. Feel as if you're going to keep it in there and it just forces to connect it, forces you to connect everything up. So, so important not to let the arms and hands separate away, connect it all up, move everything back and through together and you'll be so much more consistent with your chipping and pitching and your ability to judge distance and your ability to consistently lift the ball up into the air. So you start to get to that point where you start thinking about how close can I get the ball to the hole, not am I even going to, you know, connect with this shot. So, Really great tip, pop something up under your armpits or just that feeling of the body turning back, turning through, connecting it up, let the body move in all those short shots. For so many years I have been looking for the perfect golfing hat because it's not that easy to find. There's so many things that as a golf pro I would like my hat to have and I think I finally found it. So this hat is so great for loads of reasons but because it has a decent brim on it. So when you're wearing a cap, as you well know, the sun comes in on the side, the top of your ear is very vulnerable to skin cancer according to my doctor. Fully adjustable so it's got this lovely stretchy band inside so it's not going to blow off in the wind you do not want to be worried about if your hat's going to fly off when you're playing golf so I love that so much. It is 50 plus UV protective, it's lightweight, it's cool, it's very flexible. It is crushable so when you go traveling you just pop it down in your bag and it's going to pop up again for you beautifully. So I love that so much about it as well. It has a marker magnet built into the hat so you just pop it on and off here like so. You can use your own marker or I am including an annual like golf marker for free when you buy a hat. It's so great to have it so handy right there. It is stylish so it looks nice on. You can wear it anywhere you like, men's and women's so it's unisex. And a quick tip to finish off with so that you don't get hat head when you play. I always used to take my hair push it back before I put my hat on and then when at the end of the day when you take your hat off your hair will just fall forward and it will look fine you won't get that sort of flat hair look that you usually get when you wear your hat so push your hair back before you put your hat on so grab one today a fantastic ultimate golfing hat